My name is Afi, um, and I'm studying biomedical science here at Oxford. So, well, a friend of mine, uh, Ashley, um, she did media and publishing here um, when she her parents moved from Florida. So she was saying you should apply to Brooks, and I was like, I have never heard of it before. And she said he was in Oxford. She's like, you would love it because it's a town that suits you. So I was like, okay, I'll look into it. So when I looked in the website and I saw exactly what I was planning to study, they were offering and it just looked amazing. I decided to check it out myself and then I did and then I got in. So I came down to visit and I decided to stick around and uh, see how, you know see what else I can actually get from here. But so far it's great. I chose it because of the town, I chose it because of the university and I chose it because it had everything that I actually needed um, in order to make that big move, in order to make that big change. And, it was just a place that I felt like she was right. I'm going to fit right in. And the university was just at the heart of the city. And I was like, oh, perfect. So I'm coming here. I want to study there. And that's what I told my mom. And it's like, I'm going. So she just encouraged it. And I haven't left since. So biomedical science was something that I love. I love research. And that's a huge part of um, what I want to do with my career later on. Um, I want to be able to actually do a lot of uh, research-based um, work, either from either within the hospital or a uh, private researching company. So it was just something that I've always been interested, you know, interested in. And I knew that medical science is something that if you do um, take on that degree, you would have to do a lot of research. It's more scientific, of course, but still, the research is there because you have to read a bunch of literature reviews. Um, but yeah, I think I, I chose it because of the research base on it. I want to be able to actually like use that in my career later on and find out, do research to find out things that can actually better my patients, better um, the NHS, you know, um, departments as well. So. Yeah, it's interesting, but it's, I chose it because it's interesting. It's just as simple as that. So yeah. <laughs> I've decided to actually stay on and do neurography because uh, my current degree is absolutely amazing. The teachers are amazing. And of course, the university is astounding. Like, I have seen what they can teach. I have seen what they can bring and offer me. And because of that, I don't want to go somewhere else when I've actually become, you know, like become so accustomed to the way they actually like present themselves here. And learning here is just, it's just very easy. You can talk to the teachers and they can make things very easy for you to understand, very clear. And I don't see the point of actually moving because he has everything that I want. So, and it's a great university. It's absolutely an amazing university, very beautiful. So yeah, that's the reason, that's a big, big reason. <laughs> Ah, difference in teaching. Um, I would say my previous one, you can actually, you can stay at home and you can watch a video about a class that has been documented um, virtually. But I actually, at that stage of time, it was nice. You can stay at home and be lazy. But here actually, um, I like the way they make you involved, like they get you involved in school. They want you to come to class and learn. And because it's necessary, you know, you're studying something to do with people's health and to do with medication and a lot of chemistry. I don't see any point doing it at home. You have to, you might as well just come to class and do it right there where you can actually get somebody to explain every detail in person and you can get it, you know, get your work done hands on and get all the practical that's all involved. Just learn in person and it's just, for, it's just better. It's different, but it's good. Like I've become used to it. So. They're very precise, they're very clear, they are well organized because they have their, um, they've done their research and they've done their homework clearly so they actually come to class prepared and you don't actually have to watch a teacher, you know, juggling a bunch of uh, papers in a classroom looking lost. So they're very, very organized which is something I really love because if I'm lost I don't expect my teacher to be lost. So, um, so yeah. My teachers, they're just, they're amazing. They're very precise, they're clear, which is the best thing about learning when it comes to medicine or anything to do with medical terms. You have to understand or it's being related and they can do that, so which is great. I had a section at once with a Skype, a Skype call that I was talking to one of the admin back in Hawker Hill because she was showing me the rooms just to actually make sure I could, uh, I actually feel at home because I haven't been able to uh, come down and check it out myself. So they were way helpful than I actually could imagine. Send a bunch of emails, they reply back within, you know, within a few hours, it's already there. Um, 
questions about basically payment to about um, where you would actually go for food shopping, all those little details. They all were very helpful. They provided it. They had a list even with all of this information um, listed on it, so which was very, very helpful as well. So they were just there, you know, 24 hours, seven, basically helping us as students because we were leaving our homes, leaving, you know, what we were used to and then coming all the way over here, especially for me. So I thought that was really, that was really amazing of them to actually just make our lives so much easier and less stressful. <laughs> so it was a good move.